Now, welcome back to YC. If you're looking for something to do this weekend, we have the plan for you. For the third time in league history, professional bull riders Pendleton Whiskey Velocity Tour will buck into Greenville. It's returning to the Bon Secor Wellness Arena this weekend, and we are joined by one of the bull riders, Brian Titman, to tell us some more about his career. We talked to you yesterday on, on Zoom, but now you're right here in Greenville. Welcome right to Greenville. Here. Thank you all for having me. Yeah, we're, we're excited to have you. I mean, everyone's excited in the studio about the bull riding. Perfect. <laughs> the bull riding show. We have lots of questions. Lots of questions. Okay, so <laughs> let's give a little bit of your history because it's this is in your family. Yes, ma'am. But you're like a multi-sport athlete. You're into baseball and football. Yes, ma'am. And I loved your reasoning for not wanting to go to TCU to play <laughs> football. You didn't want to get hit by a bunch of football players? Yeah, and I'm a little string bean, so I wouldn't get <laughs> I was like, what, were you ride receiver or yes, what? Ma okay, I figured you had to be receiver. But yeah. you <laughs> wouldn't mind getting tossed around on a bull. No, oh. ma'am, I've done it since I was a little bitty kid, so. It's all I've ever known, and it's not too bad. So that's where the family component came in, where you're like, I've been surrounded by that, so it's like, I, I know what that's about. I can ask some questions about that. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Do you remember your first your first ride? I remember my first bigger bull. I got on, I kind of blacked out because everything was moving so fast. I wasn't <laughs> breathing in the buck and shoot, so I ended up riding that bull, got off him, and I was like, man, it kind of worked out. And you're like, that, I you're did like, it. You're like, hey, yeah. When do you, because you, it's one thing, like, growing up with it and being around it, but when is the first time you actually – all right, I'm getting on, it. like I'm sitting on this My thing. My first thing, I was three years old, I got on a sheep. And ever since <laughs> then, sheep? yeah, I got on a sheep and started riding horses when I was a kid. And after that, I just kind of moved forward. <laughs> Oh my God! For someone sitting at home that maybe come to the show, want to get into the adrenaline, but they have no idea. They know the goal is to stay on the on the bull for as long as possible. Eight seconds, right? Eight seconds. That's but like anything, the... anything past eight seconds, you're just showing off. Yeah, yeah. you're like <laughs> it's like different level. And is it like in your head? Is it slow motion? Like we eight seconds, we're like, oh, that's nothing. It's but in your time. head, it's probably oh, like absolutely. eight yeah. minutes. It's, it's a long time on there. But if you can kind of make everything kind of stay calm and simple, it's, it takes. Some Time goes on. Do you have some like pre bull rituals that yeah, you do? I do. I eat five peanut M&Ms. Five. Five. Just Why five. just five? I don't know. Just need a sugar rush. I <laughs> just need five of them. Certain huh. colors? No, it doesn't matter. Everyone asks that same question. Right. No, any color will work out. Any color will work. All right, so, so peanut M&Ms. <laughs> just five M&Ms. Right. So we have some gear here. So t tell us some of the things that you have. Uh, the main thing is your head requirement. You know, this right here takes care of your brain. Your nice smile, all that good stuff. <laughs> and you have all your teeth. Yeah, all your teeth. Are they're all real. No, they're all my OGs. Uh huh, they're OGs. Uh, you got your rope, which is what you hang on to. The bell is just a weight, so the rope comes off after you're done. Okay. You got your spells, for, your spurs for secondary grip. All that is, they're not sharp enough, you can feel them. Yeah. Um, the only thing they do is if you need them, they're extra grip. And then you got your, your vest that takes care of all your main organs in here, all your other stuff. So something does step on you, and this vest is designed so if they do step on you, they'll kind of slide off you. Because okay. how much do the bulls weigh, typically? Uh, 1,500 pounds plus. So Almost a ton. Yeah. Almost yeah. <laughs> right there on a the rib yeah. would be kind of... Now, you, you've, you know, been doing this and have won a lot of championships, but you've also, you know, had a few injuries. Yeah, that... you got to take the bumps and the bruises along the way. Yeah. I, I have a lot of metal in here. I was built together. I was put together better than I was built. So uh, Our favorite line. Yeah. Yeah. You told me that the other day. Yeah. I was like, I need to start using that. Yeah, I I'm all right, some... though. But no, my, my worst injury is definitely a broken hip and pelvis. I broke those in 2011, so... Yeah. Wow. How do you get back? I mean, I know it's like you got to, you know, it's like when you ri would ride a bike and you'd fall yeah. and you have to get back on. I mean, it's the do same you thing. You know, I just put all my faith in the good Lord above and yeah. he's going to take me when he wants me. So regardless, I'm going to live my best life right here on this earth. <laughs> there you go. I That's like that. Saying. Now, does it still count if you're on the bull and you're like hanging sideways as long as you're on it? As long it, as you're touching them. It touches <laughs> you're touching them and the whistle yeah. blows eight seconds, you're getting your score. Do there you still go. have it? Well, so people can come out this weekend and, and check you out at yes, the uh, Bon Secours Wellness Arena. I think tickets are are still available, so you can go to the, the website to be, buy those tickets online. Yes, sir. Well, that's exciting. I was hoping that you had like a, you know, a little Drake playlist or something like that that got you in the mood. <laughs> no, I'm just, pretty simple. I can listen to anything. As long as it's got a beat, I can rock to it. As long so as it's got right. a beat. Just a little Blake Shelton and some <laughs> peanut m and That's all you need. <laughs> well, we're going to be, it's fun like having someone to cheer for. You know what I'm saying? Perfect. So, yeah, we, we got you. We'll be coming we out yelling. you're one of our kindest guests that's yeah. been oh, on the gosh, show. Very yes. courteous and very, uh, very nice. So we yes. appreciate that. Thank Texas you. manners. Yeah. We appreciate it. Good luck yes, this weekend. Very cool. It.